What's going on guys? Welcome to Abdominals Interval Training Volume 2. Today we're gonna stay a lot on our wrists, so if you know that your wrists are a little bit fragile, do the wrist warm-up I just posted on the channel. I will link it somewhere up here and uh, let's not waste any more time. Let's get on the mat and let's do this. As usual, we're gonna do 10 exercises and we're gonna hold them for 30 seconds and we're gonna only take 10 seconds of a rest. You ready? Let's do it. First exercise is gonna be tuck ups. So you start in a hollow position, swing your arms, bring your knees into your chest, stay nice and tall and swing back into your hollow. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Hands overhead and Perfect! Next is gonna be a very common exercise, the beard dog. We're gonna just hold the position for 10, 30 seconds. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. We start on all fours. You reach with the right leg, you reach with the left leg. You're gonna lift everything up, keeping the rib cage in, and you hold for 30. Ready? And let's go. Squeeze your right arm, stabilize, keep your hips even, push that right hip towards the floor, lift the left hand, pull the ribcage in, tighten that right knee and stay. Release, 10 seconds of a break, and we go on the other side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, let's go. From all fours, reach forward with the left, and lift, stay nice and strong. Pull the ribcage in. Regulate your breathing guys, keep that left knee super straight, push the left hip towards the floor, square those hips. And release, brilliant. Next is going to be a very tough exercise, we're going to be sort of close like this in that V up position and then from here with your hands off the floor you're gonna try and straighten the knees straight up without falling on your back okay so stay nice and proud straighten the knees and bend them ready five four three two let's go balance straighten the knees tap the floor stay strong guys Point those feet, don't fall on your back. Strong core on this one. You should feel it on your thighs as well. Last one, and release, brilliant. Okay, next. It's going to be the same as the beard dog, but this time it's going to be a plank beard dog. So instead of having the knees on the floor, knees off. It's gonna to be tough. Try to give me your best effort and five, four, three, two, one. 
start in a plank position legs are nice and wide reach with your right hand reach with your left hand left leg and lift them both keep your hips square stay strong guys stay super strong Stay, stay, stay. And release. Super challenging one. Show you on the other side. 10 seconds of a break, guys. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Let's do it. Start in a plank. Right leg reaches. Left arm reaches. And let's go. Super strong. Square those hips. Do not rotate, guys. Lock that right knee. Super strong core. It's normal to shake. And release. Amazing job. Okay, now, next, we're gonna do one tuck up. And at the top of the tuck up, you straighten the leg and you go back into the hollow position. Okay, pretty simple. Five. Four, three, two, and one. Point your feet, and let's get it, guys. Hands overhead, tuck, balance, straighten those legs, bend, back to hollow. Combining the elements. Super strong core here. Just keep going. One more. Hollow and release. Amazing job, guys. Next, an easier one for you. This time, we're gonna go in a side plank. We're gonna try to pull the bottom rib cage up and we just stay 30 seconds. Five. Four, three, two, and let's get it. From a plank position, swivel the feet and pull the bottom rib cage in. Create that rainbow shape with your body and just stay. If you want a little harder, top leg on top of the bottom leg. If you want a little harder, top leg off. Stay strong. Reach in a position with that top arm. Reach in a position with that lifted leg. And release. Well done, guys. We go over to the other side. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and let's get it. From a plank, swivel. And reach. Pull the bottom rib cage in. Stay nice and strong. If you want the more advanced level, then go for it. Lift the top leg as well. Push the floor away. Stabilize. And back to plank. Little rest. Brilliant. Next is gonna be a crisscross for 30 seconds. 
Repair, down on the floor, hands behind your head, legs up in the air, bringing the elbow to the opposite knee. Three, two, one, let's get it. Up into the flexion, let's go guys. Keep your elbows wide. We go back on our hands. This time we're going to do side planks, dips. So from a side plank, you're gonna lower your hips to the floor and then you're gonna push with your hand and lift the hips back as high as possible. Five, four, three, two. Let's go guys. Plank, swivel, keep that side plank and tap the floor with your hips, feel a stretch. Pull everything back up. One, you can keep one foot on top of the other for balance, in front of the other, sorry, for balance. Try to touch the floor, but it's not a requirement. Just go as low as you feel a good stretch in your side, and then push back up. Super strong shoulder, super strong side body. Two more. One more. And finish. Well done. 10 seconds break. Ready to go on the other side. Six, five, four, three, two. Let's go. Plant position and swivel. Arm overhead. Let's go hips to the floor. And one, two, three, four. Pull that bottom rib cage up. Two more. And one. One more, and finish, brilliant. Okay guys, next we're gonna lie on our back and finish with those abs. So I want you to drop the knees over to whatever side you want and get a good twist. Both hands are gonna be behind your head and then you're gonna bring your top elbow on the opposite side of the knees, really stretching those sides, really stretching those obliques. And then from here, from the stretch, you're gonna come up and you're gonna lift both elbow and try to bring the elbow to the hip. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's go. Get into the stretch and really feel that side shortening. Elbow to the hip. Get a nice twist in your spine and really shorten that rib cage to pelvis space. And one, and last one. We're gonna stay up, we're gonna pulse it for 10, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and release. 10 seconds of a break. Drop the knees on the other side, guys. You get a nice twist. The elbow reaches on the opposite side of the knees. Ready? Lift both elbows off the floor. Let's go up and touch your hip. One, two, get that stretch. Three, four, 
Squeeze that side body, guys. Reach away. We're gonna stay up now and pulse it for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and release. Amazing, guys. Next, both legs on the floor. We're gonna reach for our heels. Ready? Bring the heels as close to your hips as possible. 3, 2, one, let's go, reach for the heels, one, two, and three, and four, and five, and six, and seven, and eight, and nine, and keep going. Beautiful work guys, don't give up. We're on the next one, we're gonna stay up and we're gonna go for side bending. Ready? Five, four, three, two, stay up as high as you can and touch your pinkies. One, two, three, four, your pinkies. Three. Don't lose height. Stay up, guys. Stay up. Hands behind the head. Finisher, guys. The finisher. Ready? We're gonna curl up and pulse it for 30 seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. Curl up and pulse it. Well done guys, thank you so much for joining me in today's abs workout. Feel free to do one or two more rounds of this sequence for a more complete workout and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace. <laughs>